Like many other countries, on every May 9th, Mongolia celebrates the Day of Victory in the World War II. There is a good tradition of laying a wreath at the memorial complex to Soviet soldier at Zaisan Hill and at the monument to Marshal Zhukov by the Minister of Defense and the Russian Embassy. Sticking with the tradition, the Minister of Defense, Mr. Tsolmong, Russian Ambassador Azizov, Belarusian Ambassador Chipurnoy, Kazakhstan Ambassador Koblandin, and other officials took part Monday in a ceremony in honor of the great day. The people of Russian Federation or former Soviet Union played a tremendous role in safeguarding independence of Mongolia. During the toughest days of the World War II, the Mongolian people extended helping hands to them. Our younger generation and youth must respect and move forward the historical ties and friendship between the two our nations. The great patriotic war has left its traces in the history of Russia and Mongolia, making the friendship of the two nations even more closer. On June 22, 1941, when the war starts, the government of Mongolia reaffirmed its loyalty under an agreement established with the Soviet Union and confirmed its commitment to help the Soviet Red Army to bring victory. It is noteworthy that the next day after the war started, the Mongolian people launched a national campaign on voluntary basis to help the Red Army under the motto, All for the Victory and All for the Front. The aid the Mongolian people were providing during the wartime ranged from food, cloths, horses, gold, money, animals, to letters encouraging soldiers. Therefore, the Mongolians celebrate widely the Victory Day every year.